I'm Riley Tedrow. I'm a PhD student at Case Western Reserve University, and I do research with Dr. Gavin Svensson at the Cleveland Museum of Natural History. So the resources at the Museum of Natural History have allowed me to do both in-depth morphological measurements as well as genetic sampling in the DNA lab. We conducted the first formal survey of praying mantises in Rwanda, which documented a substantial increase in the praying mantis diversity of both Rwanda and the region. We surveyed four localities across Rwanda, three of which were national parks, and we used sweep netting, light traps, and for the first time, UV light traps, which are small, compact devices that we made um, just ourselves. And we found that they were just as successful at collecting mantises and bringing in um, insects as our very large light traps. We worked with the Katabi College of Conservation and Environmental Management. We instructed students as to uh, collecting techniques and also general information about entomology. We also brought students into the field so that they could get some hands-on learning experiences with the insects. We collected 739 praying mantis specimens, which is a pretty significant number. That constituted 28 new species records for Rwanda and 20 new records for the region. We collected DNA from all of these specimens and they now reside at the Cleveland Museum of Natural History and we've taken high resolution photography of all the species and this will be associated with a barcode and posted to the project website on which anyone can access and observe all the specimens we collected. So by establishing this baseline of information and providing high resolution photos of all the specimens we collected, most of which were identified to species level, this will allow rangers when they're going in and potentially adding to their own insect collection, which we're getting them to start doing at this point, uh, they will be able to get a general idea of what species reside in these parks and can collect data as to how these species numbers are progressing uh, in subsequent years. I think it's amazing that there's so much untapped diversity still out there, and I want to go in and find these species and tell their stories.